I'm James McLaughlin here at beautiful Wikiwachi Springs. This is the second time in my 66 years that I have stepped foot into this theater. In 1973, I became a U.S. Navy deep sea diver because of my uh, the passion that I inherited here. So it took a while for me to become that U.S. Navy deep sea diver. This is what inspired me to do it. Two weeks ago, I knew I was uh, coming to Orlando to, uh, for a conference. And just, I said, what the heck? I better go visit Mickey Springs for the second time in my life. And when it just so happened, I caught an, an online news article about uh, Mermaid Vicky, and she was celebrating 60 years of having been a mermaid. And uh, she was in the mermaid shows when I was seven years old in 1958. I'm not sure if she was actually in that show. Good chance she was. But in my little boy's mind, for all these years, Vicky has represented the magic of mermaids. So, and I'm today, through the assistance of John, I'm meeting Vicky. That was my second wish, was to meet Vicky. So two wishes in 66 years. You know, they're very powerful. And so, uh, when, you, when I graduated at DC Diver School, I was awarded a pin. And the pin is a, uh, a deep sea diver helmet flanked by two porpoises. So I've been carrying that around because I would like to give that back, return some of the back to Ms. Vicky. Because to me, uh, Ms. Vicky represents all the mermaids that ever were, and are, and are to come, and the magic that they represent. So, believe in magic. Be careful with your wishes. They're very powerful. And if you ever get a chance, come see the mermaid magic. You can keep watching springs. Hi. Hi, Vicky. Do I dress you as Mermaid Vicky? No, Miss no, Vicky. Mermaid Vicky's fine, but just Vicky's fine Vicky. too. I love your shirt. I bought it for you. Oh my God, that's <laughs> awesome. Such a special, that's the second time I've been here. And your name is? James. James. Nice to meet you. Yeah. And uh, I'm not sure if you were in the show that I saw in 1958. It, there's, there's a lot of years to <laughs> try to remember such a thing, but the fact that you remember receiving it is awesome. Yeah, so I think maybe that maybe my grandma went to the gift shop and bought a little mermaid token yeah. and told me it came from one of the mermaids. That was good enough. Yeah. But in my, my little boy's mind, I remember the mermaids and I had manufactured over the years the fact that there was a deep sea diver in there walking around too. <laughs> so while I was here, I think I touched the glass and made a wish. I've only made two in my life. The first, that wish was to become a deep sea diver, walk across the bottom of oceans with mermaids swimming in the back. I never specified I had to see them. Now that could have been one of us too. <laughs> <laughs> and so, uh, and then uh, I kept that in my heart. And uh, in 1973, I became a student at the U.S. Navy uh, Diving School and became a deep sea diver. And the whole time, you were my inspiration. And uh, what, what, what you do, Vicki, is you represent for me. <laughs> oh my goodness. I knew it was going to happen. I understand, but I understand. All the mermaids that ever were, or that are, and are to come. And the magic of the mermaids. So if you give me a pause for just a minute. Okay. First is this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're so special. Thank you so much. And then the other thing. <laughs> oh I my to God. To Toby, or whatever it was. And so whenever you gra we graduate uh, special skill schools in the Army, like uh, airborne school, yeah. they award you wings. And you've probably seen military people with what's called special skill badges on their uniform. And so, this is for you. Oh my goodness. And one of the things that's pretty cool is that when I, I just awesome. noticed it this weekend, about the mermaids swimming. The official seal of the U.S. Navy Deep Sea Diver School is on the bottom. 
like a lot of schools. And flanking it are mermaids. So the mermaids were in the background the whole time. I pulled torpedoes out of uh, submarines mm. and, uh, you know, dove to the bottom. Half the time you couldn't see. But uh, one of my, my th I wish was three parts. To be a diver, walk across the bottom of oceans with mermaids swimming in the background. Now, I'm a good magician, so I didn't specify it that I had to see them or how many there were. But I know they were there. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> and I have walked across the bottom of three oceans. Not all the way across, but I stood on the bottom. So. And did you serve in any wars? What wars did you? This was during like Vietnam. I did three tours of Vietnam. My brother was a helicopter pilot in Vietnam, and my brother-in-law flew a, a transport from, um, um, refueler. Thank you so much. You're so kind and so sweet to remember. Meeting James was a was um it was a, a bittersweet meeting James because it brought back a lot of memories of that year, 1958. He said he was uh, seven years old. I was still 17 at that time. And you know, you never know who you're going to touch and who you're going to meet. You 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 meet people that you never forget. And he never forgot the mermaids, and they they inspired him to do other things with his life, which which is astounding. When you know that you've inspired someone, it makes you feel very very special. And how to explain it? It's a magic. It, it's it's all about the magic of the water. We feel it when we're in the water, and people some people get it. Some people get it when they see us in the water. It's like a magic that comes through the windows. It's, it's always there. I very much want to thank James uh, for this special moment today. It may have brought tears to his eyes when he was trying to explain it to me, his feelings, but it touched me and I, when I, when I parted with him, I said, I love you, James, and he said, I love you back, because we shared that moment. We shared the magic of the memories he had and the inspiration that I gave him or that or that the mermaids gave him. And it's awesome when people come back and bring those memories back. Uh, what can I say?